We can probably forget about getting 75 points, man. We just got to try to win this game because right now, it has been awful third quarter. Absolutely awful. Just do it! Nothing is impossible. Stop giving up. Yo, what's going on people? Welcome back to a brand new video. So today we're going to do something a little bit different. Not just a regular squad builder, but adding a little twist to it by making it a challenge. I thought to myself, what kind of challenge I could do with a card of the day that we have in store for you guys. So when I was opening packs about a week and a half ago, I did indeed pull Mr. Kobe Bryant. That's right, Amethyst Kobe Bryant. Uh, one of the better cards out right now in the auction market. Uh, I have him. He's going to be our card of the day. And the challenge today obviously because Kobe Bryant is known for his scoring ability and his scoring prowess the challenge is indeed going to be revolved around scoring okay and for the squad I went ahead and took nine of the best scorers in the league uh, we already have Kobe Bryant so I only have nine now how I chose the players is simply based off last year whoever scored the most points in the league not necessarily points per game but uh, total points in general okay here's the challenge since this is a scoring challenge we got to make it a little bit tough how about the goal is we have to score 75 points in my team unlimited now that's not easy not easy at all in fact uh, it's hard enough to score freaking past 60 in a my team unlimited game but look man this is a challenge we got kobe bryant we got the best scores in the nba i think we could do it man so uh, without further ado let's introduce the squad subscriber for you guys let's try to get this video to 200 likes that'll be absolutely glorious check out all the links down below in the description box and let's get started so let's start off with the first point guard of our squad uh, he's gonna be coming off the bench. Damian Lillard is indeed our first player we're gonna introduce. Averaging 25.8 points per game last season in 80 games. And we know what he did in the playoffs, man. Dude went absolutely bizarre. So let's check out his Ruby card. He's got an 87 mid, 81 three pointer, which I think should be higher. Like, come on, man. That should be at least an 85. Driving layup's really good. He could even dunk on people with an 82 driving dunk. Now, moving on to the shooting guard position. Since we already have Kobe Bryant, he's going to be our starter. He's the card of the day. We only have one shooting guard today. And I'm pretty sure you guys could guess who that is. Of course, guys, it's James Harden. Dude had an absolutely incredible season last year. 2,818 total points. 36 points per game, guys. Like, that's just unheard of. And since Harden came into the league, people already knew how great of a scorer he was. He could do it all, man. He could score in so many variety of ways. And I think it's pretty safe to say that uh, most people think he's the best scorer in the NBA. Our first small forward we're going to introduce is Paul George, who led all small forwards in points per game and total points 2159 points per game in 77 games 28 points per game for the year and paul george unlike james harden came into the league more of a defender and more of a role player he wasn't a scorer yet but uh, he definitely improved throughout his career and last year probably had his best season as an nba player uh looking at his amethyst card here you know his, his jump shot is kind of low like really 72 mid 77 three pointer 2k did y'all not watch last season? Like, like, what are y'all doing? Next up, guys, at the power forward position, we have Blake Griffin, who averaged 24.5 points per game last season, putting up over 1,800 points in a total of 75 games. And Blake Griffin's Sapphire card, uh, he only has a 43 mid, which is weird, because uh, throughout his career with the Clippers, he was a very, very good mid-range shooter. He's more of a three-point shooter now, so uh, that's good, man. We always want bigs that can shoot threes. But of course, we know what he could do inside, can dunk on people, can make acrobatic shots and can get to the line very well has a pretty solid face up slash post game as well first center guys we're going to introduce is carl anthony towns he had a pretty good season as well putting up near 1900 points in 77 total games played and Towns, since he came into the league dude was just a pure scorer already man had an elite post game still has a very elite post game and throughout the years has improved his shot mid-range and three-pointer and is a very good free throw shooter for a center so uh, carl anthony towns one of the more well-rounded scoring big men in the league next point guard guys we're gonna talk about is indeed stephen curry now technically we should be taking kemba walker because he scored more points than both lillard and curry it's because kemba walker played all 82 games but i'm not gonna put him over damian lillard and steph curry in terms of scoring i mean kemba walker is a great scorer in his own right but steph curry is on a different level stephen curry in 69 games put up 1881 points 27.3 points per game and i can't really say anything else that you guys don't know already hands down the greatest 
greatest shooter of all time, has a mid-range game, has great handles, uh, can get to the basket, not the best finisher in the world, but you know, at, at times he could finish around the rim, automatic at the free throw line, so uh, Stephen Curry, he's got an 86 three-point shot, 84 mid-range, driving layup is very good at 92. Now our next small forward, uh, of course, we have the boy Kevin Durant. Yes, I know, look, we're using Kevin Durant again, but whatever, man, the card is pretty excellent. Average 26 points per game last year, scoring over 2,000 points, one of only six players to score 2,000 points. And some people will argue Kevin Durant is the best scorer in the NBA instead of James Harden, which I can't really argue with, man, because Kevin Durant, his length, his wingspan, it's almost unstoppable to, to contest his jump shot. And we know he can shoot from everywhere, three-point line deep, mid-range, close range post fadeaways and not to mention he's got great handles for someone that is almost seven feet next up our starting power forward guys we have Giannis Antetokounmpo the reigning MVP and over the past couple years Giannis Antetokounmpo has developed himself into one of the more unstoppable forces offensively last year he put up 27.7 points per game scoring 1994 points in 72 games played now the only flaw in Giannis Antetokounmpo's offensive repertoire really is his shot like he's not a really good shooter man but uh everything else man his size his athleticism his ability to finish around the rim dude is just unstoppable final player guys we're gonna introduce is joel Embiid. And I think most people will not argue when I say Joel Embiid is the best scoring center in the NBA. 27 and a half points per game last year, put up almost 1,800 points in only 64 games played, could handle the ball, could face up, could post up, could finish inside like crazy. He can, he can knock down open mid-range shots. He can knock down open three-point shots. And checking out his Ruby card, he has a 72 mid-range, 69-3, inside scoring 84 overall, man. He's got an 87 standing dunk. And yeah, guys that is the squad right there the best scorers in the nba alongside kobe bryant man so uh remember 75 points is the goal let's see if we can achieve it all right so like i said in the beginning of the video our card of the day is indeed kobe bryant he is a spotlight series card uh, that you get when you open the kevin garnett packs but i indeed pulled him man i got lucky and pulled him i didn't sell him though because i knew i would be using him in a future video and that's the video right now man the scoring challenge 90 driving layup 84 post fade man that comes in handy post fades are pretty op in this game uh, we got 85 draw foul 88 mid range 84 3 just overall a really good score he's got a 90 dunk as well this card is definitely going to be playing a main role in achieving our challenge man remember that challenge is 75 points in a my team unlimited game yo man we've been winning a lot uh, this year for our squad builders, I believe we've only lost twice. So I expect to continue that with a win here. Now the ultimate goal obviously is to get that 75 points in a game. That's the challenge here, but of course I want to win. You just gotta win. My goodness, man, they pair me up with this guy. Look at this guy's team! Look, look at this cheese, man. They're supposed to be position locks, but the Kembe Mutombo's that powerful. Help! Me! Come on, man. We he gotta score as much as possible here. Giannis on the Kubo, a little mid range. Let's go, Giannis. Man, the Kembe can't shoot mid range. Come on now. Here goes Kevin Durant. Durant got all the way to the basket. Yup. Yup. Go, KD. Go. go. Man, what? What is that? Here's Kobe, though. Kobe, Kevin Durant, please hit that. Let's go. Kevin Durant off to a good start. Away that goes in, man. That's heavily contested. Let's go. Here goes Curry. Oh, Giannis is cherry picking. Let's go, Giannis. Let's go, Giannis. Yeah. Oh, he's playing good defense, though. He's playing great defense. Joel, do your thing inside, Joel. Do your thing inside. Let's go, man. We're taking advantage of our size. He has shown a terrific feel for how the defense is Come playing. Come on, man. Inbound the ball. We don't got much time to waste. Go. Out here cheesing. Here goes Giannis to the basket. No, what? Why do I keep? Why does he keep fading away? I mean, I made it, but still, go to the basket. There's the user steal. Giannis to Durant, who's cherry picking. Durant, go ahead. Go ahead, Durant. Do your thing. Chemistry has been terrific. Really Oh, yeah. Giannis with a block. I'd say we're on pace, man. I'd say we're absolutely on pace Durant again Kevin Durant right now is doing work man I just noticed this guy has a, this guy legit designed the Flint Tropics jersey from semi-pro you know what I, I gotta give him props for that I gotta give him props man, get that cheese out of here man no dumb shots going in today here goes Paul George do your thing yup Paul George got him in the air good patience great patience this guy's trying to this is one one of these guys trying to get steals in the backcourt and I'm gonna make him pay I'm gonna make him pay. That's right, goaltending. I don't know how that was a goaltending, but I'll take it. 
Lillard to Towns. Towns has a mid-range shot. That, that, he can't miss that. Let's go, Towns. And there's another steal, man. This is a good thing we are getting a lot of stops because we need those stops. Harden for three. James Harden. What a first corner. We're off pace. We're off pace for 100. I don't want this guy to quit, though, man. Like, I really don't want him to quit. So, uh, because I, I want to achieve this challenge. I want to go through this whole game. Here goes Lillard. Lillard to Towns. Excellent. Here goes Blake Griffin. Do your thing in the post, Blake. Do your thing in the post, Blake. Yup. I mean, you know what? Just put that. What? Blake, what are you doing? Here goes Lillard. Here goes Towns. Great pick and roll action. And he blocked me. Okay. Here's Mason. Yup, and just like that, he has the lead. I, I don't know what's going on, guys. Like, I'm getting to the basket, but I, I'm not. They're not calling fouls for some reason. Here goes Lillard again. Still not calling fouls. Okay. Towns though. Carl Towns and one. Oh my gosh! Finally, man. Finally. All right, man. Let's focus on trying to score here, man. Let's, let's not worry about the score too much. Here goes Kobe to Curry, who's cutting. Great feed by Kobe. Great job, guys. Great job. Close game right now. Like I said, let's not worry about the score. Here goes Curry. Easy layup. Yes. Here goes Kobe. Kobe just cheesing his way to the basket. Let's go, Kobe. Finally, Kobe scores. That's his first basket. Uh, Giannis in the post. He has a smaller guy on him. Just, just, just take advantage. Thank you. I don't know, guys. Uh, 75 points is kind of looking out of reach right now. I'm not going to lie to y'all. Here goes Durant posting up, though. Durant to Curry. Why would you leave Curry open? Curry for three. I need that. Let's go. Here goes Kobe. Kobe to Joel. Joel. Man! Dude, can somebody please make a layup? We can probably forget about getting 75 points, man. We just got to try to win this game because right now, it has been awful third quarter. Absolutely awful. Just do it! Nothing is impossible. Stop giving up. I just noticed, guys, we could actually still achieve the challenge of 75 points. I, I might not win this game, but uh, since I've been scoring a lot in this fourth quarter, we're only six points away, guys. We could actually do this. We have a minute 48 left. Forget winning the game. I'm trying to achieve the challenge. Ha ha! Curry, back to Kobe. My goodness, he's tightening up defensively. Kobe, hit that. Hit that, Kobe. Let's go. Four more points. Here goes Steph Curry. Here goes Curry. Curry to the basket, to Joel Embiid, if he misses that, let's go, two more points, and we're going to achieve the challenge, forget winning the game, man, forget it, jeez, here goes Curry, Curry, to Durant, Durant, D3, we did it, we got 75 points, alright guys, look, man, we achieved the challenge, so I'm good, uh, in the beginning of the video, I said it's a 75 points challenge and we got 79 man it was a very high scoring game now i could have won this game but like during the second quarter and a little bit of that third quarter i was absolutely forcing it man y'all saw it i was forcing it with Giannis, joel and beat i was trying to get easy baskets and that forced him to make a comeback and i lost the game so this loss is on me man it's on me i could have won this game but look man i achieved the challenge of 75 I exceeded it by four points, so I'm good. <laughs> I'm good. Here's a stat right here, man. Steph Curry at 13 points, 13 assists. Uh, he only he didn't he did not miss a shot. Maybe I should have been shooting with him more. Kevin Durant 13, Giannis 12, Towns 11. But yeah, guys, if you guys did enjoy that little challenge video I did, let me know in the comments. Uh, comment down below other challenges you guys want to see during Squad Builders: uh, passing challenge, defense challenge, dunking challenge, whatever the case may be, man. Just let me know in the comments, and I'll bring it to y'all. Peace out. I'll see y'all in the next one.